I was thinking here, what, how do I get to be a part of that group of people that don't attract narcissists? How do I get to be a part of that character um, or that um, behavior or a part of that um, set of um, just cases that don't attract um, predators or don't attract sociopaths or psychopaths? There's something um, um, that people have, other people have that are not like me, but not like me as of then. Right now, um, I am, because uh, I had a first set of notes that I was recording and trying to take down um, like incidents that I um, thought I was the one um, initiating, but turns out um, through seeing through the deception and the manipulation, I've realized there is a um, set of skills that I can have and possess and continue to um, reenact um, live um, in my life that can um, completely end situations that I don't want to happen. Um, and it's astonishing to me. Um, and it's nothing to other people, nothing to other people that don't, that aren't experiencing um, abuse, that aren't experiencing constant harassment or constant um, oppressive um, behaviors from anyone. We all have our problems, but this particularly is heavy um, in uh, my life currently. And so thankfully, um, the this new perspective has armed me with an awareness of authority that I do have. And I've sat down and, and used them on um, my, my children in lessons and trying to explain to them and make them aware of this and that. And uh, uh, they've started to inculcate um, some of them. And so, yes, they are being taught um, a better... Um, um, like a set of skills and thankfully I am seeing them come out of the cocoon of naivety the cocoon of people pleasing the cocoon of being so desperate for people places and things that will give ourselves and lend ourselves at the expense of ourselves so that brings me joy it brings me joy that I'm already seeing a shedding of behaviors that does not benefit them and a not just a picking up, but a practice and an application of behaviors that will keep them so far away from users that um, uh, which is one and also just aware just aware so that the, if they were to be told by a friend or, or a family member that this, 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 whatever is going on, my children will be able to identify with terms. Uh, this is what you're going through to that friend or to that family member. And, um, be also, and also be able to lend them some suggestive t tips and strategies and, um, be able to, um, share in that conversation also some actual skills that have helped them and i give all glory to god all glory to god that i don't have to live in that fear but be rested in the cheerfulness of that reality i have created some of those and put some of those skills in um, some workshops and i'm gonna start um, showing those workshops and I just can't wait to release people from the bondage that they think that they're well that they already that they really are in but when you uh, arm people with awareness not just terminology but with set of skills that can help them to draw the line um, and let people know this is what I'm not going to do this is what I'm willing to do I have a workshop for boundaries for adults and boundaries for children and a workshop for um, um, learning authority, what that means and in, in learning how to use that in all instances across the board. Um, another workshop for, um, it's called Argue Awareness. And that's where all of my work started. 
understanding that there are some people on this planet earth that don't mind being in an argument with you till the till you dry out and pass out and i'm not about that life i don't want that at all and so um i've sat and wondered why i've how why when did i get into this this whirlwind of confusion um there was a point a time in my life when this was not happening i wasn't looking myself in the mirror and saying i'm not crazy i'm not crazy <clears throat> and here i am now realizing that their craziness and the skill and the in the in the masking of their words makes me think that um oh oh must be sweating makes me think that i am crazy but it's a facade so not to fall for it so there's milestones that you can reach in these workshops and you'll be able to not just use um the information and be aware but be able to use the information in your life during the workshop and just rinse and repeat in your life and get out of situations that you don't want maybe even jobs relationships that you don't want check out my workshops for argue awareness boundaries for adults or boundaries for children if you need your children to be aware of them and then also um, I have a workshop for nonverbal um, cues to um, teach your children at home before they get out in public and also um, um, the other workshop that helps with learning your authority.